Mrs. Churchill was amongst the distinguished visitors who came to see Lord Halifax off from a northern base. The Prime Minister, dogged and determined as ever, was there to wish his colleague Godspeed. A small tender was ready to take the visitors out to the big ship that was waiting to carry Britain's goodwill ambassador across the wintry seas to America. A hearty greeting was awaiting Lord Halifax when he came aboard from the tender. Mr. Harry Hopkins, President Roosevelt's personal representative, was there to give a message of encouragement to our great statesman on the eve of his historical adventure. As the Premier and his party left the ship, their thoughts must have been full of gratitude with the knowledge of sending such a worthy ambassador.